Hello, hello, thanks for tuning in. Today we're gonna take a look at this common grill that's found online, eBay and Amazon for the Dodge Ram line of trucks. It has the light up bull noses in the front. It's very popular, but we've experienced the LED lights flickering and going out. So we're gonna show how to replace these things. You just remove the grill from the vehicle and then on the back side of these, there's about five screws and it just separates. So you take it out and get it on your workbench. All right, at this point, you just wanna take a razor knife and slice the glue around the perimeter of both sides here and take a small flat blade screwdriver and pop this black panel off the back. All right, once you pop the back panel off and flip it over, you can see the LED lights here. And the common problem here is those little unions or jumpers there they like to get corroded, burn out, whatnot. And these LEDs are on a flat, rigid, hard piece. So any vibration will start to wear these things out. But you can go ahead and start just cutting those little plastic tabs off there and getting this thing separated from the backing here. All right, once you remove the flat LEDs, you see there, it's just a rigid circuit board. You can get rid of them and then you can just clean the back side here just wipe it down with some alcohol wipes and clean that area up, but you can get rid of this and we'll start working in here. We're gonna clean the inside here with some alcohol wipes on both sides so we can get the LEDs mounted in there. All right, once you decide to lay your LEDs in there however you want, it's whatever LEDs you choose, but the LEDs that we got are switchbacks. We don't know if we're gonna use a turn signal feature with it, but the white lights are bright and they're like a flat rope type. So they kind of contour to the inside of this thing very well. You want to go ahead and take your backing plate and set it back on there and fish the wire through the hole. All right, once you have the back on and the wire routed through, you want to go ahead and just put a new layer of silicone sealant all around to seal everything up. All right, we got everything back together. The lights are in, the glue is dry. We're going to go ahead and test it. This is what will happen upon startup. And that's running. And if you wanted a turn signal, we're not sure if we're gonna put it. That would be the turn signal. And then the light would come back on. All right, and we'll show the final sequence of everything. First, we'll do the startup, left blinker, right blinker, and then hazards.